Welcome back, everyone. Someone in the world develops dementia every three seconds, meaning upwards of 50 million people in the world have dementia. Many of those people are being cared for by a friend or family member, a task that can seem daunting and overwhelming. Well, Ken Branham joins us now with High Plains Senior Care Hospice to talk more information about a, a, a little seminar they're doing for the caregiver. It's a caregiver conference to help navigate that role. And Ken, we have done uh, several things um, uh, with, with, you know, with the elderly as we uh, age gracefully. Right. We've done conferences with that. I find it unique that it, we've got to put some focus on those caregivers because that's a yeah. tough job. It's a very tough job. Yeah. Yeah, the Area Agency on Aging, mm -hmm. uh, once again, is putting this out. But, yes, that's what we were talking about. That I have been with, and this is not just dementia. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's just across, you, the board. across the board. And I see caregivers go down before the patient goes mm -hmm. down because they don't take care of themselves or they feel that they've got to keep moving, keep going. Uh, one of the big deals is guilt. Mm -hmm. um, okay. We saw you leave your husband at the house to go get your hair fixed, you know, and, yeah. and so guilt there, and then, and that's what I've always said. If you don't put enough guilt on yourself, yeah, other people other will. Other people will do it for you. Do it for you, and so <coughs> it just it just a beat down. And I've known so many families where the caregiver says, "I can do this. I'm going to do this. I love my wife. I love my husband," right. and they go down. And so the idea of this conference is really to put the focus on you. The caregiver, and 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 how to take care of yourself uh, mentally, how to make sure that you're in it, and and the important thing is to know that you're not alone. So I love the name of this: finding hope, humor, and heart yes. in caregiving. Tell us about, about a few of the things that you guys are going to do. Well, that's you know suggestions, and mm -hmm. and anybody that comes in, uh, people I meet with, a lot families, I don't tell them how to do a thing because. The only expert in grief and everything Stem. is the one yeah. that's doing it. And, yeah, and so suggestions, and, and it's just things that uh, I didn't think of that. Many people we've met with, I've talked to, and I'll go back the next month to talk to them again or whenever, and they'll say, you know, Ken, what you said last time really made a big difference. I didn't say a thing. A lot of the time, I talk a lot, but when I'm with people, yeah. It, it comes yeah. from within. Yeah, insight comes from within. So it's coming up this Friday, November 8th. It's from 9 to 4 o'clock uh, in the afternoon over at the Central Church of Christ Commons area. That's right down here downtown, just at uh, mm -hmm. 1401 South Monroe. And I want to thank the Area Agency on Aging of the Panhandle to do that. Where can they go to get more information about this? That, they can call 651-3482. And that's the Panhandle uh, AHEC in its yeah. step. It, it said there was a cutoff, but when I talked to Jamie over okay. AAA, uh, through tomorrow. Yeah, make the call. Uh, get on this. There's no charge. Uh, get yeah. it taken care of. Muffins in the morning. Of course. And then free lunch. Yeah. And so. They don't call you the muffin man for nothing, Ken. <laughs> Thank you. When we come back, whether you just want to get away from the wintry weather for a weekend or you're one of the thousands of snowbirds who head to the Sunshine State every year, we've got an expert uh, and a few picks for every single budget so you can ditch the layers and soak up the sun.